Okay. Someone, somebody in the movie theater was wearing one, and I saw him in the I saw him in the parking lot, and I was like, he's going to see Tiger Three, or I'm incredibly racist. Dup dup tiger. Yeah, can you say it? Bencho tiger. Did you say Bencho tiger? I don't <laughs> think that's right. There's my wife's. It was very similar <laughs> to uh, Tiger's. Uh, it looks exactly the Tiger's same. Tiger's iconic. Yeah, I'm gonna just wear it. Just gonna. It feels right. Hey, welcome back. This is uh, welcome back to our stupid reactions. The so Corbin. Yeah, yeah, yes, I'm Zach. You can follow us on Instagram, Twitter for more juicy content. Thank you, David B. Sports on Patreon. Follow us for our alcoholic uh, updates. Have alcoholic Actually, updates. I spilt some Jameson right before this, and that was very sad. You are such an idiot. <laughs> and welcome back. And uh, we are to do... Uh, today we're doing a movie review. We're beatboxing. Uh, to the new 2023 film, Tiger 3. The, film. the least creative title name for the entire Tiger series. Tigers they, they in the high. The, that was fantastic. Eek the was tiger the and Tiger Three. We were like, we don't want to come up with any more names. Hey, tiger but the title three. sequence, the title sequence where the the three was in the E and then it comes out and it's that was cool. dope. Uh, anyways, so obviously we just saw it. Uh, if you haven't seen our, uh, we did a watch along of uh, both of them, but only have one of them up because somebody, de- I don't know who fine. deleted it. It's somebody fine. deleted the Tigers Need a High we one. Did, we did but a we have a review of that one as well. To do a review. So you can go see our thoughts on those two. Zach, uh, unbeknownst to me, uh, also watch Patan and War like today <laughs> in anticipation for it. What do you think about those? Just quick uh, thoughts on those. Quick thoughts. I know this is not about uh, War was great. That was a good one. Patan, I I, I loved it. Patan you loved was it? so good. Oh, I there you go. I, well, I know people I actually loved Patan. We might have to do a, a separate Patan review. So, because okay. uh, people love that. So, when that he film. showed up in this movie, <laughs> don't. Okay. Everybody already knows. But, anyways, <laughs> uh, but what we're going to start with, because it is new, uh, we're going to start with a non spoiler review and then we will get oh, into Oh, yeah. Spoiler. Never mind then. Everybody, like, it was all over the internet a week ago. It's fine before <laughs> it came out um it's that is not a spoiler but try not to spoil anything else uh we're gonna get to non-spoiler first just so you can get our thoughts and then we will talk about more spoiler stuff as we go into it okay uh so rick i'm sorry that's been doing this for like four years now uh zach oh and also your this was not only um was this her first indian film ever Oh dang! Okay, uh, so this, this was uh, his, his 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 wife's first Indian film ever, and Zach's and hers first ever Indian film in theaters. Correct. 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 Nice. Very nice. Besides Slumdog Millionaire. <laughs> yes, that one, that Indian film, uh, the best of them all. Go and since some people don't know sarcasm. We know that's not a Indian yeah. I'm being sarcastic. Sarcasm. I'm okay, being so, so sarcastic. There, there are people that have no clue about what sarcasm is on the internet. Uh, Zach, oh, your initial get, buckle up then. <laughs> your initial thoughts of non spoiler thoughts of Tiger Three. Non spoiler, so entertaining, so good. A uh, lot. Oh, there's a lot in there, mm. but uh, it, it 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 ran seemingly. Like it was really like uh paced really well. Even though there was a lot in there, it, it, it got to where we needed to go really, really nicely. Um it was uh if I'm comparing it, which it's kinda hard not to. To the other this. tigers or the, the other I'm gonna compare it to the other tigers first. The other tigers, okay. Um the other tigers better than the second one. The first one, I don't even know if you can. I don't. I don't even want to put the first one in this. Yeah, like, universe. I, the same thing. Like they, that of the entire universe, think... that's probably my favorite film. But it's also like the least of like the entire universe. 
I think they made they made Tiger, and then they uh, uh, like, they decided we can make this bigger. <laughs> we can make a universe, and then like totally like that's a separate movie. So yeah. the first one's great on its own, but as the universes go, um, Patan's the best. Yeah, okay, then, very cool. Then this one. Okay, uh, mine would probably if if we're not including the first Tiger. Let's if not include not, the first one. Okay, it's if we're not including so, the first Tiger, because that. That would still that's be almost my like first. a parody of what's going on. <laughs> that's true, but I still like it the most, and Me I can too. watch that one probably more than all of them. But um, I, okay, we'll, we'll, get the the we'll get there at the end. Sorry, we'll get there at the end. Sorry, we'll get there at the end. Because yes, yes, yes. Uh, you asked me a question. I, I enjoyed you, this one oh, as well. Yeah, how'd you like um, it? It was a. It was a, a a fun experience. My theater was empty. Zach had at least, you said, 10 people. Were there any cheering? I think I think they started becoming about 14 when the movie started. Uh, yeah, there was whistling every time. Oh, fun. Good. Yeah. I'm glad, they, I'm they glad there was some. It. it was good. I'm glad there was some. Uh, was mine was empty, which no is actually fireworks. Very, very, yes, which is very common for uh, Indian films. Uh, well, I'll be the only person in the theater. Uh, but I also usually see it like midday on a work day. Yeah. So um uh, most people have jobs um but yeah i thought it was a <laughs> i thought it was a, a really entertaining film with the standouts for me outside of tiger which i thought he was he was very tiger in this and he did a good job but the standouts for me are going to be katrina i thought she did a phenomenal job i loved her stunt choreography she killed it she needs her own universe i feel like i feel like she needs her own film What'd you say? I agree. I thought that's the, I was agreeing with you because I thought that this was going to be, it almost seemed like it was setting up like this was her movie. Yeah, absolutely. Uh, the and then uh, the villain, Imran Hashmi. Uh, and now that you've seen them all, I think he is the strongest villain in the entire universe. And in my opinion, it'd be interesting to know what you think about that with Judd, uh, John Abraham and Patan, obviously. Um or or maybe oh, you can let me know if you think of something else. Um, no, I agree. But especially in terms of acting wise, he is a uh, he is a very, very good actor, especially in the Tiger series, by far the best villain. Um, like there's not even a memorable villain in the Tiger series before him. Um, John Abraham and Baton was fun, but it, it, it not his performance wise is not as strong as Imran Hashmi's um i mean he was stronger sure which i actually thought there was some criticism people like i feel like by was never intimidated by emron hashmi because obviously he could totally dominate him physically but i'm like you don't have to be dominating physically uh, to be a good villain like mm -mm. Did most you, of the he best just, villains just in other spy films like <laughs> uh just well, the greatest one in mission impossible and then Philip yes. Seymour Hoffman, you think he can beat up Tom Cruise? No. <laughs> I mean, mo all of James Bond's villains, Blofeld was like uh, his main one. And it's, a, it's an old guy, old bald guy with one eye. It's like it was it was about his brains, though. Yeah, and yeah. That's kind of what this was. So I thought his performance in this was very good. What did you think about him? It was so good. No, I loved I loved him the whole time. I thought he was so, he was so natural. Like he wasn't campy. Like the scene. Oh, I don't want to give it anything. Anyways. Yeah, yeah. He just had really his scenes were really natural. Um, yeah, you're like it made, and he made being a villain, which is you know the best thing about any villain is it made sense. Like he had his real reasons, um, and that was the same thing with Baton. But I don't want to start talking yeah. about. Well, I might need to talk to you about Baton. It seems like, it sounds like you loved it. I really um, loved uh, it would have been cool to maybe. But yeah. Know. Go ahead. This one, he was he was just he was a really good villain and really good actor. I just really, um, I thought he was a good. I don't get the the criticism, I guess, because he wasn't a uh, physical foil. But as far as acting, I feel like he because yeah. Tiger's so stoic. You needed someone a little more charismatic. Yeah, which, yeah, absolutely. Which oh, I think him as a villain worked. I thought he worked well with uh, uh, against by. Um... And I like uh, I liked Bai's performance and just I mean he was he was Tiger he's he was I feel like he's not known for his acting prowess really as a, as a performer but this yeah. is one of his most grounded like characters I think he was probably born to play this 
tiger like he he plays him very very well and i think he did he did a very good job in this one as well i think he you could tell he was um he didn't do as much of his own stunts as i think in the other two yeah just he's getting older so it it because katrina looked like she did all of his like she did i felt like she did like almost all of hers uh and it felt like they did a lot more they did a lot more cuts with him to kind of cheat it a little bit not taking anything no, away he, from it. It's, he's, he's, I mean, he's, I think he's like 50 something now. So he looks do great. First of yeah, all, he, he does. does. He was he, comparing, especially since I've watched, kind of watched him back, back to back. He does look a little, little older in this one, just in the face, but he still looks great. Um, But he's also his stunts. He's so, he's so broad. Her yeah. stunts is very, is very nimble and quick. And, uh, she is just really good. I loved her. I, yeah, yeah. I loved her scenes. The, uh, the, um, there's obviously some, there's cameo, obviously the big one that everybody already knows about, um, which was cool. Uh, it was a, it was a, it was a lengthy scene compared to what he had in tiger, which I think if we're comparing the two, the one in Patan was a better cameo uh, scene overall than the one in this one, for sure. I think I agree. Um, but this one was still really, I mean, a lot of like just like the entire series there's a bunch of moments in the film that are like obviously that could never happen you can't chase people on ice in a car obviously we all know this but you do it for the fun of the audience <laughs> no there's a lot of those like nope he's not okay he's doing that okay there's he's... there's they're swinging from explosions they're <laughs> that's an action movie and that's what i love about oh, yeah. action movies is is uh the suspense of of reality like it's it's obviously you're not you're not watching a, an action movie to be like oh i wonder if this is if this is gonna happen in real life you know you're watching it to just be entertained yeah absolutely and and i, I was I think, entertained absolutely and i thought for a two hour 30 30 film it actually no, went by it, pretty well. Um, I've seen a much, much longer two hour, 30 minute films before. Um, <laughs> yeah, I felt like that's short. Like when, yeah, uh, I think Patan was about that. I feel like I've seen too. shorter films that felt longer to me because of how well it was paced. The director himself is, a, I, I feel like he's a very good director. I've seen a few of his films, including a uh, band Baji Bairat, which is the Ranveer one, but that's a, that's okay. a rom-com. It's a really good rom-com. You'd love it um it's a it's a really good one so i thought he did a really good job in pacing he also did a really good job in terms of story um through i think out the tiger films i think those have the strongest story throughout the universes um regardless of if like even if you like baton as maybe an action movie more in terms of how much stuff is going on i think the tiger series probably has the best linear and strongest storyline um of them all even if you just compare like one to one as opposed to obviously these are three films so you get a a long continuation but um i i feel like the tiger series have the strongest storylines i can agree with that um i also think something like kind of like what you said is i mean we've watched both these characters because it's not just a tiger movie it's a it's a z movie too i mean katrina yeah and so we're you get to know them, especially if you compare it to the other spy film universe. Those are just great standalone stories, but this one you're you're more invested because you're you've seen them between three movies. Um, but then yeah, and then the plot itself, I feel like they get better and better. And it's and I knew it was gonna be great because I feel like spy movies do really well when the villain is it's a personal. Yeah. And I the the, the other critics yeah, the other criticisms I'd have is that even though I think the story in terms of the universes are the, the strongest, that still doesn't mean they're like these innovative stories. This is still a typical no. spy film, but that's not what you're really looking for from these films is the like this is a, a very typical <laughs> he's stolen the codes. Uh <laughs> The, just the, yeah. the all the all being codes you know <laughs> uh it's nothing it's nothing new it's not they're not reinventing anything um to compare it to another genre that's why i like romantic comedies you don't go to a romantic comedy 
expecting to be a, a twist to happen or be blown away. You do it because you you like the the feelings it makes you feel, and you like uh you know how it's gonna end. That's yeah. why I love bad action movies. You know the hero's gonna win, even though it doesn't look like it. You know he's gonna get his ass we whipped, but you know yeah. at the same time he's gonna win. Um, you're not you're not looking for a twist now. If they can do it, fantastic. But most of the time, you're like, I just want to see things get blown up. I want to see the yeah. hero win. Yeah. Um, the I thought the the score in this one was nice. Um, score was fantastic. The locations yeah, the, were fantastic. Yeah. The the song at the end, which uh, Rick and I had reacted to, is is okay. a great a great song. Uh, I think the the beginning I, song, the love song, is I like this one more than I like the love song in the second one. I feel like just because I agree, uh, it just felt better. It just felt a little more natural uh, in this. Obviously, there's a lot more going on in this. Um, it, it, like there's a lot of backstory going on in in, in that song. Yeah, but, it's not just a love story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but I thought that was that was nice. Um, I thought a lot of the stunts were really cool. The CGI, even though it was better than, um, cause I think it's, it's better than noticeable. Actually, it is noticeable. Uh, not as it's good as you like, I, uh, there's films that we've seen just this year or last year that are action movies that the CGI is uh, in terms of like, what well, you don't notice it. Like you don't in Hollywood really. Um, the spy universe is kind of just they've Patan was I, I know you just saw it. There was a ton of bad CGI in Patan. A ton of bad CGI. So I think there wasn't as much in this one because it actually wasn't as CGI reliant in this one, I feel like. Uh as, I feel as like Patan. It started with the beginning case. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was kind of, I feel like that that was it. And but I still you could tell it was fake, yeah, yeah, but yeah. it was still really good. And then that middle scene with the the cameo and then but yeah you're right i think the rest was more practical not as reliant could... on cgi but the cgi wasn't as good as you would want it to be either um so that 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 is a downside for sure but to be honest i mean uh, if you've seen any of the recent marvel movies uh they're i have the cgi okay yeah this cgi is so much they're getting worse and oh, there's, there's drama between that yeah it's so bad <laughs> but the, this cgi was better than those so if we're comparing it to hollywood they they'd be great yeah there you go um so yeah that was our our, our non-spoiler thoughts uh anything else you want to say non-spoilers before we get into some actual because there's some big spoilers that we don't want to spoil for anybody um that you might have already heard but also we'll get more in depth to some scenes if we want to talk about uh more in depth but anything else non-spoiler that you want to talk about no i think this one was more uh heartfelt i mean we can get out with the spoilers i feel like this one's more heartfelt but i also feel like it's because we've we've um got to really know these characters yeah it's the third installment in the oh you can uh, go ahead and um rank them uh so you you would say in terms of the spy universes, you would rank Bataan one. Yes. And hold on. If we're not we're, counting we're, Tiger. We're not hold including not the, first, the first Tiger. We're not, we're not including Eek the Tiger because... And if we, if uh, we want to, Eek the Tiger is the best. Eek the Tiger yeah. started them all, and but it doesn't really also, set it's, up it's, the universe. Yeah. It's not the best action movie, for sure. It's probably the worst of the action movies. But in terms of a movie as a whole, I like that one still the best. Uh, because <laughs> after after for the most part all the spy universe after eat the tiger they follow the same type same of pattern like they feel like yeah. they're all part of the same you've yeah, yeah. part of the same world yeah eat, eat the, the tiger, tiger doesn't feel does doesn't feel, feel like that so besides eat the tiger it's Patan. yeah tiger three uh tiger Zin, uh tigers in the high it's in the high and then one war. war okay i thought uh yeah I don't want to get. I could get into all of yeah. that yet. <laughs> That's an interesting. I'd uh, love to talk to you yeah. about those because uh, yeah. that was actually one of the first. Uh, War came out the first year we did the channel, uh, and that was one of the first big Bollywood films we had ever seen in uh, theaters that year. Real quick, uh, did you did you like War? Yeah, yeah, we liked War for sure, but we liked it just as a as a, a kind of a mindless action film. It definitely the story is definitely not the strongest. The uh, outside of the your main Rithic, the acting's not the strongest. Um, but uh, mine would probably be similar to yours. I I go back and forth actually between 
this being over Patan because I like the full film of this as opposed to I like the first half of Patan a lot. The second half I don't like as much. It fell off for me in the second half of Bataan. I can see uh, that. But, but also it's, it'd be really because there's a lot of Easter eggs of Shah Rukh Khan. And that's this is your first Shah Rukh Khan film. Your first ever Shah Rukh Khan film is Bataan, which is yeah, ridiculous. And... <laughs> <laughs> that was now, like that's his most recent, right? No. Then I have to go backwards. Didn't they come out in 2023? Yeah, but he's had another film this year already. Oh jeez. See, it's, a, it's, a, it's a bit well, yeah, he's the biggest movie star in the world um but the it is another action film called Jawan that you 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 might be able to watch it's it's more south indian uh feel to it because it's south indian director um so it'd be interesting to see what you thought it's a very massy and and all that kind of stuff okay he has one more film coming out on christmas this year oh jeez but it's not an action film it's a um it's it's i, would, I wouldn't mind seeing I know this again. We're not talking about Baton. I'm getting pissed because I want to talk about it. But I want to talk about this movie too. But I think I really enjoyed his acting because I like, or at least his character, Baton. In Baton. In Baton. Because he's so charismatic. He's so charismatic and he's yes. so, he's funny. We can tell, well, we'll do a Baton okay, review. Don't sorry. worry. Don't worry. We'll do a Baton review. Because uh, now I'm, I'm really interested in your thoughts. Um, <laughs> Yeah, so but anyway, so yeah, mine three. would mine would might be yeah, if you're not counting Eat the Tiger, uh, or if we are, that's one. Um, probably that. Then Tiger Three, because I like the entire film, and then uh, Baton, and then Tiger Two, and then War. Probably. Yeah. Okay. Um, but we kind of switched. It was, I had a lot more issues with Baton than I did this film, so that's probably what's going to separate them. Uh, in terms of CGI issues, in terms of just dragging issues in the second half for me. Um, and the story is just a better story for me in Tiger 3. Um, even though Patan might be, uh, you could argue, I think, a better action film, for, for sure. Yeah. Um, a lot more action. Um, and a better cameo. But either way, that was our non-spoiler review. So if you haven't seen the film, please go watch the film and come back. Um, and we're going to get into any other things we want to talk about. So now that you've seen it, uh, spoilers. Uh, what do you think about the uh, the post credit uh, scene? It wouldn't have meant uh, it wouldn't have meant anything to you, by the way. If you I know, didn't watch I know. War. I'm so glad. And guys, I I read comments. I, I just, I'm a sucker for reading the comments. And in the comments, you're lot of new. Kept, <laughs> I know. <laughs> and in the comments, uh, people kept saying. No, what is he doing seeing Tiger 3 if he hasn't seen War or Patan? So I was like, fine. So I watched uh, Cut Up because I'm I'm a dad, so I have a lot of responsibilities. But when the kids weren't bothering me, I was watching War last night, finished it this morning, and then during work. <laughs> no one, my boss isn't going to watch this. Uh, during work, uh, I watched I watched Patan. And so, yeah, the end credit scene made sense. And now I'm cu curious: Are we? Do is it a sequel no, to War? Yeah, War Two is happening for Tiger sure. versus Tiger. Ver okay. Yes, Tiger versus Patan is happening first. Uh, I think because I okay, because I was wrong. a little disappointed because everyone told me to watch War, which I still enjoyed. I, I'm glad I watched it. Yeah, that's the but, only thing you get from it. <laughs> but I was like, he didn't show up at all in the meeting in the movie. I was waiting for him to show up. Yeah, uh, and then uh, he showed up at the end, and I had to explain it to Amber. Um, so, uh, were you was the theater excited when Shah Rukh Khan showed up, though? Oh yeah, we got whistles, we got claps. I I got excited right when the song was playing with the it was playing the song the Patan song. Like, oh, it's Manny him, John. Yeah, and then uh, I was like, yes. <laughs> I did Amber? Excited. Amber obviously didn't see any of them. No, she hasn't seen a lot. Yeah, what did she think of the film? She liked it. She said it was really entertaining. She didn't feel like she wasn't bored. She, uh, it kept her going. She th wasn't worried about subtitles, which she's seen movies with subtitles. But um, yeah, she was like, I didn't know if I could follow along. But she's like, no, it was it was great. Yeah, um, cool. I, I I said it's it's like I said it's like your thrillers that you watch where there is a uh, you know a foreign scene where someone's speaking subtitles, but except it's just the whole movie. 
Yeah, exactly. Uh, the whole movie. But she enjoyed it. Yeah. The, 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 For the, this the, being I, her first. Yeah. The Kabir scene at the end, um, I thought was really cool. It, which it also so just didn't cool. feel like him at all, though, in the first one, though. Like he was like a ninja now. <laughs> I know. I, I thought, it, and the way it was setting up, I thought it was a new villain. I didn't know what well, was it happening. Is, oh. It is. Uh, there's a there's the the actor in it is um that's playing okay. the villain is uh Junior NTR. He's actually a South Indian actor. You haven't you okay. don't know him because you never haven't seen RRR yet. I know it's on. I might. Well, the people that are watching this probably don't care, but there's other Indians that do because this is a Bollywood film. That's a South Indian Telugu film. Okay, but it looks uh, good. No, oh, it I've seen the previews and well, that's and that's one. Really if good. you ever start doing uh, your own watch alongs, that I'll have you do a watch along for. Um, okay. be, you could do it with Jesse; he'll love it. That's a it's an absolutely yeah. fantastic. I wanna, and I also want to show Jesse Patan because I think he would love Patan. Yeah, RR is a fantastic action film. But anyways, okay. he's a he's he's a South Indian actor, uh, and he's going to come in as the villain for for War Two. Ooh, okay. so that'll be real fun. I hope we get a little more like um in the next ones like actual like avengers right the the whole film is with all of them as opposed to this, this still felt like mostly a standalone film right um uh, and i'm glad they're taking their time i'm glad they are taking their time as much as i'm ready to see them all together take your time because you, you don't want to just rush things just to rush no. it yeah and that's how th that was also your first rithic film ever right war yeah. rithic Roshan? Yeah, I think that was the the Greek god of India. The I mean, <laughs> I was telling my uh, hmm. my gay friend at work that you would love Indian films. <laughs> so so many beautiful I said, people. I, I said one because he likes action movies and stuff. And I said specifically as I said, but a bunch of handsome dudes shirtless. That's and true. They, they look great. They look fit. But yeah, yeah, no, he was. War was. We could talk about war too. War was an entertaining film, and yeah. they were great in it. Um, but yeah, so that was a that was a fun little. So I'm excited. Well, so the post credit, yeah, that that something else. Amber, uh, she actually pointed it out in the back when you finally see his face, Kabir's face. You see a sign that says, um, something like "Hello." I, I I forgot it. Something something really cool where it, it was lit up and it was like hello, hello. Oh, it's like hello there. But then the O and the T go away and it's hell here. Oh, I didn't see that. What a little nice little catch. Yeah, and Amber caught that. So what a nice little catch, Amber. Uh, yeah, he is a he's known as the Greek god of India, one of the sexiest I men you'll it. ever see. Uh, also oh, has he's... two thumbs. I don't know if you saw that. Um, Everyone has two thumbs. Yeah, he has two thumbs in one on one hand. Yeah, interesting. Yeah. I didn't notice that. Uh, too busy looking at his pecs. Yeah, yeah. He's a gorgeous face. Uh, what was that? Uh, you were talking about Imran Hashmi, and you were like, I don't want to give a spoiler away, but you were trying to talk about a scene of of his um, earlier. So one that really was like, he's he's really good was, um, and that it was not a huge spoiler, but it's when, um, when he arrests himself when he's with um, uh, Katrina after he finds out that his wife um, is killed, he. She said she was telling him, Hey, you can own your mistakes. And the way he laughed, it was just such a natural, it wasn't a villain laugh. It wasn't a hokey laugh. It was just like, like I even thought, I was like, How would I, how would I, because that's what I think of. I'm like, How would I have I done that to make that so natural? Uh, because he just, he just was, it was just real in the moment after finding out that his wife is, is an unborn kid is dead and that his plan didn't work out and he's about to be court-martialed but he still laughed at katrina's her saying hey you can own your mistakes like like that's i i'm, I'm not gonna own my mistake it's not my mistake it was just it was just i really appreciate when things look natural like like even in a, a crazy scene like that yeah absolutely and, and that just made me realize like oh he's he's 
really good. We've seen a couple of his films. He's, a, he's I've always thought he's a very good actor. Also, did he remind you of Colin Farrell? <laughs> I, could, I I definitely see I definitely saw that once you That's said that. That's all I see is Indian Colin Farrell. It's Especially in the beginning when he didn't have the beard, you just yeah. see the eyebrows. I was like, who does he remind me of? And I remember. Oh yeah, that. I would uh I would 100 play his character. I can't because I'm not Indian or Pakistani, but I would. Uh, would just you play, to make a villain, I would you play would, action movie. Would, yeah, you play, play the play star it. though. You want to play the action star? Yeah. I want to uh, play the action star. I have no desire. I, I, I'm like I could definitely I could do that. Uh, I wanted, to, I wanted to do I Emron, the stunt man. I wanted the Emron Hoshri me role the entire time. That's his. I that's the, the that. villain's like, actor's name. Yeah, I was looking at that. I'm like, me and Corbin could do this. And Absolutely, could play the villain, and I could play the the hero because. And then after that's where I've been fighting my boys like I'm Tiger. <laughs> I've been doing really cool stuff. Now. I've been flipping. I hurt constantly, but. Dup dup tiger. it's so interesting to actually hindi yeah it's so interesting because there's a lot of references in a lot of these films that i get now because i've been doing this for four to five years and i'm 400 films in uh to a lot of these actors like there was references to old films in tiger three that that, that's so uh, funny that that you do that that you you would not have picked up on in like uh in terms of um when Shah Rukh Khan and and um Bai were on um the uh motor motorcycle and sidecar it was a reference to one of the f- most famous indian films of all time called Sholay um there was references he to did old... say he's like did they crash yeah uh there's references to old films of theirs together uh <laughs> that they've had which is there's apparently there's one uh Shah Rukh Khan um by film uh from the 90s called Karan and Arjun with Gajol which we actually haven't seen yet so maybe uh maybe we need to get you in okay. for uh you can I'll watch, watch it with us um uh, but um so like and, and also in Patan as well um like there's he does a direct quote uh from one of his other films in that film and you caught I, this after seeing it? Oh yeah, I knew it exactly when he that, was saying that's it. That's that's awesome. That's really no, cool. like because like when he's in bed with when when he's trying to steal a thing and he gets in bed and then he's yeah, like, I love Karen. I love you, Karen. Yeah, that's a that's direct from line was... from Dar. <laughs> <laughs> it's a very you know, famous some of the stuff. A I'm very saying, famous that was line. So random. Oh yeah, there's in that's Bataan funny. in Bataan specifically. There's a bunch of references um so it's it's super interesting just like some I, that's how i was obviously in the beginning and still am obviously with a lot of references i don't get every dude, reference i probably this I is probably how get i like, feel i probably get like 10 percent of references when i take people to like comic book movies and they do things from deep cut comics <laughs> that i know this yes. is how I, I don't like this feeling i don't, I don't like <laughs> feeling that in the know I'm anyways I'm mad, uh well that was our review uh I, let us know what you thought about it i've actually seen a quite a few um reviews of people that actually didn't enjoy it that much and or thought uh the uh other films were were better which i you know when it's everybody has a different opinion obviously but it's just it's it was strange to me i was watching i was like this this is a good movie i don't know what you guys are uh no i, I kept I me, what you guys are watching man um, it kept me guessing, especially when you uh uh you don't know if Katrina uh, Contr- was saying like she's a clone. She they 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 did the thing in war. There's her face. She's got to be there's something. Uh, but I no the story was really good and I the villain really held it together too because he was so good. No, I I enjoyed it much. I felt like the second one was so. It dragged yeah. a bit. Yeah, that that one dragged more than, uh, than this one. I think they're this about one, the exact same uh, length, I believe. But anyways, let us know what you thought about the uh, movie uh, and your thoughts on it. What should we have Zach watch next? Let us know. I don't know what to do. Down. Bye. <laughs>